Hi, I'm Merrick Demana. Welcome back to Let's Play Joan of uh, Wars and Warriors, Joan of Arc on the PC. We're all alone. No soldiers left. Let's save the day by being a badass. There's an abandoned town just ahead. Seems the English have sacked and looted the poor town beyond repair. Aww. That's not great for that town. Baldwin Wissendere. That's an odd name. You all want to join the party? Stomp on your face. Feast on this. Taste my foot. Hmm. Oh, there's another cluster of them in the town. All archers, I, I notice. Bread. Something of value in this town, right? Well, the English did sack it beyond repair, so I guess they already took the valuable shit. Because frankly, I wanted a new, better weapon. <laughs> Spiked club is obviously not great. Ah, the English training camp. That'll work.
so confident in that shield of yours. Not right now, baby. You've been fed. Sorry, my cat's wanting my attention. She's, she's actually annoyed because I, I got up way before her this morning. Crossbow, by the way, which we do not have. Because we missed our chance to get it. Well, there will be other crossbows, so do not worry about that. So I think this training camp didn't really have a whole hell of a lot of stuff in it. find items in there. You're making me taste my foot. You're making me taste my foot. Taste my foot. I don't know what the pur uh, pur purpose of having spikes on our armor is, but whatever. There's a blacksmith. Ooh, diamond. Hardest of known minerals, the diamond strength can decrease an enemy's damage sustained during melee combat. Functionally useless for us, but whatever. You got now. You can just just drop down on them in a jump attack and hand them all this shit.
Come on, you're not getting away. the ladder all Beast so on so this. carefully. Beast on this. Uh, Nigel is the Bowman Castle. Nigel Cower. Kristen Bowes. Jean de Metz is going to go save the day now, because he needs to level up some more. I wonder if Leio will have killed everyone by the time we get there. Or something he'd do. Why isn't everyone all going together in a big party? I have my two knights I'm willing to sacrifice for the cause. I'm too fast for you. I'm too fast for you. I shall be For you, take that. You're a dead man. I'm too fast for you. I'm too fast for you. You're a dead man. You're a dead man. Fuck, there he goes. I'm too fast for you. 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 Take that. I'm too fast for you. Wonder where that eel's going.
Let's deal with this dragon. Oh, it's a full moon. What a horrible night for a curse. I'm too fast for you. Take that. Ooh, curse. Amulet of Yahweh? Yep, Amulet of Yahweh. I'm too fast for you. Take that. You're a dead man. Let's take that. Let's take that city now. I think it's now guarded by one fucking archer. It shouldn't be too hard. Two. It's guarded by two archers. I'm out. I'm after you, are you? Asshole. Ah, uh, there's also a heavy, heavy infantry. Don't worry, guys, I got the heavy infantry. I'm too fast for you. Oh, there's a whole troop of guys there, too. For you, I shall prepare. You're a dead man. I shall prepare. You're a dead man. Ah, we win! Oh, shit! Alexander de la Pole! You French are laughable! Tell me, have you so few warriors that you must seek assistance from the weaker sex? Ha! It matters not, male or female, you shall all die under the might of my English steel. Wondering why I'm not attacking Alexander de la Pole yet. You're a dead man. I, shall I feel it should be a one on one. I shall prepare. You're a dead man. I'm too fast for you. You're a dead man. Meaning I'm gonna kill all the soldiers, then I'm gonna kill them. Yes, he is the brother of uh, William and John. Was it William and John so far? Yeah. Take that. You're a dead man. I'm too fast for you. You're a dead man. I shall prepare.
and the, we got the Cressy Broadsword. Named for the famous battle from the Hundred Years' War, this 14th century sword combines clean lines with ease of handling. Only Joan of Arc may use. Last! You and your ilk have caught me off guard, but mark my words, we shall meet again. Of that, I promise! Off he goes. Level them up a bit. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, mission debrief. You have successfully captured the English camps in the vicinity and have eradicated the possibility of a threat to the city of Orleans. Let's look at the color. Commander's dead. Lair had no units left. Neither did Joe. Joan of Arc had a full six. Debrief. Joan got a B. Joan got a B. Nail got an A. Victory in Tuhel. Oh, that's right. That's a little tower, that. Mm hmm. Ah, yes. The beautiful Loire River Basin is much more pleasant now that we've driven the English from the surroundings of Orléans. Indeed, my dear Etienne, but this is not the moment to bask in our success. For if we are to deliver our Dauphin to Rim for his coronation, we will need to expel the enemy from Tourelles. Mind you, this is no easy task. Ha! Huh. Tourelles is fortified by an adjacent military installation, that of St. Augustine. A tower that features formidable arbalests, controlled by numerous mechanical pulleys. That's almost impossible. This does sound quite dangerous. Fortunately, we can count on our master siege engineer and Pullman general, the Duke of Alençon, to aid our cause. Oh. Milady, I would like to introduce you to Jean II, Duke of Alençon. Glad to make your acquaintance, Milady. My favorite character. After hearing of the plight of our innocent citizens in Orleans, I felt compelled to be here to assist you and your noble cause. Very well. Let's move on and destroy the up in the English. Let's go, there's some headbanging to be done. Bang your head! I will head towards the vicinity of Torrell so I may scout the area. I shall inform you of any enemy activity in the area. Oh, we can't get, we don't get to play this. And I shall head yet. towards Chinon to rendezvous with the French siege forces, led by Dunois and Dillier. Okay, he's off. The English are retreating toward the west. We may either head west and take the initiative against him, or capture English camps due south. I think we should capture English camps. Come on! There's okay. a country Jean to be Dement saved. is utterly inaccessible at the moment, uh, which is unfortunate because well, he has our sword. Just gonna put some food in our troop inventory so we don't lose our entire army this time. Wasn't great the last time it happened. I also want to keep some inventory space free in case we find new weapons. everything they need. Also conveniently free up a good amount of inventory space. Okay, so weapons, you see. I know inventory management is not the most exciting, but it is important. He can hold the broads. He can hold the sword for me. There. Oh, 
Okay. So, so uh, what level are people? Joan is 10. Nagi is also 10. So plays Joan for a bit, then when she goes to 11, it's off to Nagi. Good, Nagi is following us. Oh, which reminds me. They're invincible. Oops. We'll make the others invincible when it's their turn. We've got a nice little English trap here. Okay, uh. I was thinking it would. Uh, I'm being oh my god, we're critical, critical kill. Isn't what I expected would happen in any way. Um, hmm. We don't seem to be invincible at the moment, and I don't like that at all. <laughs> Seems to oh, okay, we're back. I get okay. Ooh. Hope that worked. I hope we're invincible. Where are these guys running around? There's a mace man. Lord Talbot, we have captured Jean de Metz, your so-called general. If you want to see him alive again, meet me in the De La Forêt Sombre if you want to see him alive again. Though I'm invincible. This does, I don't like this new development. This being able to be injured thing. This isn't what I uh, signed on for. So the capture John the Not a fan of these new developments. Ah, inventive bolt, that would explain it. <laughs> that would actually explain it very, very well. We didn't type it. We weren't invincible. We were invincible. Guess my spelling, which is the problem here. I just assumed the cheats had stopped working. <laughs> I mean, you 
should probably rescue Jean de Metz. He does have my sword. Oh, it's him. Ah, it's John. Oh, William. The French human tent on bridging our camp. Men, Pullman, protect the gate. Archers, fire at will. We must not allow the enemy entrance. Your plan does not include closing the gate, I see. of mosh pit. Time for Nair. Ah, fellow maceman, eh? I refuse to believe that my superior training has been overwhelmed by these riotous peasants. You and your filthy ilk will meet me ag with me again, mark my words. And now William's off, William de la Pole. Prison key. Quartz crystal. Natural quartz can bring balance to the metal elements of nature, granting the bearer increased weapon. Tiger's eye, but better. Let's 
let's um, kill that small group of British soldiers outside. Joan of Arc just teleported in. She's been doing a good old Nightcrawler strike. It's like, boom! Yeah. I must thank you for rescuing me. It is my understanding that English forces are fortifying Torels and have assembled a tower with devastating fighter power. In Guin's Epicier, or whatever. Espicier. Mon dieu, I am free once again. I overheard that the English are heavily garrisoned in St. Augustine. They have relocated the key a good distance away. If you wish to enter St. Augustine, you will find the key in the southeasternmost enemy camp. The English did not confiscate this little fa family heirloom I have on me. Here, please keep the quartz crystal, my servant purpose as well. I have freed the French prisoners. Now, guy defeats Sir William Glasdale, Alexander Dolopole, John Dolopole, and Lord Talbot. And rescues all the mechs. Anything else to do along the beach? Oh shit, we have access to uh to what all song right now. Ah, uh, at all song. What level is he starting out? He's already level ten. Uh, Albert. Six HP. Don't bother to knock. Looks pretty cool. I like the lion theme on his shoulders. But we uh, we have some more stuff to do before we uh, get to him. We got the cowbird bow. Yeah, we're going to. Um, Keep going along the. We're not gonna go into the. Let's take a look at the map. <laughs> we took Jean de Blanc. Fieldbois is ours. We should get to Fieldbois. Yeah, we should go through the woods next. We're gonna be going through the woods next time, save on the Mets, all that fun stuff, then we'll get a chance to uh, play as the Duke of Adolfo. So, I'm gonna do some inventory management. See you all next time. Ciao. Hi, thanks for watching. This has been played and recorded by me, Merrick D'Amato. The art was by Rafael Agrona. You can find a link to their commission page in the description below. And if you, li if you like this video and wanna see more like it, like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time. Ciao!